Hello YouTube, this is Morgan, Aerospeed Speed Prime, here with my next Avatar and Korra news update video. And we've got some new merchandise to talk about. Uh, unfortunately, no pictures of this, but um, it, it's the sort of stuff that, like, it's it's simple, it's not the most exciting merchandise, but it's like, okay, cool, That's this is the sort of stuff that probably should have came out around the time the show was airing, but uh, I suppose better late than never. So. What we have here is three different products. It's technically, I suppose, four, but one's like a two-pack. Um, but what we have here is from Inside Editions. So that is the publisher of the Avatar uh, Legacy book. Um, so we've had stuff from them before. But all of this stuff is basically stationary. So here is the Legend of Korra hardcover ruled journal. We also have the Avatar The Last Airbender hardcover ruled journal. And then we have the Avatar Lost Airbender slash Legend of Korra notebook collections, the set of two. So let's quickly read the descriptions on these and then I'll, because obviously there's no pictures as you can see on any of them, I'll show you some of the other like uh, properties that Inside Editions have done these notebooks and journals for to get an idea of what potentially the core ones are going to look like. <clears throat> So, celebrate the beloved animated Nickelodeon series Legend of Korra with this hardcover journal featuring Avatar Korra's adventures through Republic City and beyond. Uh, it follows Avatar Korra as she seeks to keep the balance between the mortal and spirit world, following the footsteps of Avatar Aang, yeah. Featuring Korra, Mako, Bolin, and iconic imagery from the show, this deluxe journal lies flat and includes 192 pages of high-quality archival paper, making it the perfect gift for fans of the groundbreaking series. <clears throat> fairly standard 192 pages is a decent amount I suppose hardcover journal out January 8th uh, 2019 and uh, yeah we have here 13.3 by 21 centimeters so that's a that's a pretty big ish journal it's not like overly massive but it's it's, it's big enough Um so that's that, uh, 14 pounds 16, so it, it's fairly expensive. I think that is close to 20 euro if you were to convert it. Um, uh, Avatar 1 is basically just the same as that, but for Avatar stuff, you know, Team Avatar, beloved characters, heartfelt storytelling, um, featuring Aang, Katara, and Sokka, as well as iconic art from the series, uh, 192 pages, high, ar high quality archival paper, blah, blah, blah. 13.321, same date, 8th of January 2019, and the price is basically the same as well. Um, this is a bit different though, because you get obviously two books and the price is only 11.20 here. Same date, um, but it celebrates two of the most beloved series, uh, obviously here. Um, this handsome set includes two notebooks showcasing the gorgeous and iconic art of the series. Each notebook contains 64 ruled acid-free pages of high quality paper that invites fans to record their memories. Okay, so these are two 64 page ones for a cheaper price. That makes sense if they're going by like basing the price and the number of pages that you get. And to me this seems like the most interesting of the lot if I was to actually get any of them, but of course it completely depends on what's on the cover, what the the art inside is and which one looks the best. These seem a little pricey, if uh, especially if like the image on the front isn't particularly great. But as I said, it's this is just the sort of stuff that like it, it's cool to get, but it's not going to excite anyone. But it, it's cool that we at least know about it. Kind of surprised that this is the sort of stuff they announce without just having a product image because like it doesn't seem like it's anything overly complicated now as for like what these actually look like and um, the hardcover ruled journal uh, I find one of the more recent ones is this this is the their Marvel Avengers Infinity War journal so this is obviously a screenshot of what it looks like this image I suppose tells the story a little bit better that's what it's gonna look like Um, pretty cool you have the kind of stretchy kind of thing to keep it closed um, the hardcover you can see a little bit clearer here it is a quite thick cover and she's got the texture on it and uh, this is the one of the best pictures I could find for what like the pages actually inside look like so when they say ruled it's literally just it has lines and you can see there also this is this is from I think a Wonder Woman one that they did a while back and you can see a couple of the pages are going to potentially have some art kind of like printed on them 
Um, and then if you look at if you look up other ones as well, you can sort of tell that um, they also uh, do ones where they literally have a couple of kind of art pages at the start and end. And um, so it'll be interesting to see what they do for um, you know Avatar and Korra. Do they do the kind of art drawn on a couple of the uh, first pages, or do they just put in art prints? Because all of them make note of the fact that it's going to feature characters plus iconic art from the series. And um, so, you know, th th that could be pretty interesting. As far as the uh, notebooks go, which is obviously this product here, um, this is the best I could find uh, in terms of a two-pack that they did. Pacific Rim Uprising Notebook Collection, a set of two. They confirm here it is 64 pages. And um, here's a slightly up-closer image. You can see that the, the main difference is that they're... Uh, What's this product size? 5.25 inches, 8.25 inches. So they're probably similarly sized for the most part. Um, uh, but of course, they have like a, a soft cover as opposed to the other ones. So uh, yeah, it like it's just standard stationery, but it's going to have some Avatar Korra art on it. Obviously, the hard covers are going to look a little bit more deluxe, sort of like this, as you can see. Depending on how they do this, like what color they choose for the cover and what logo they choose to have on the front, you know, an Avatar or Korra one of these could look actually pretty nice. Um, especially if like, like, like say for myself, like, you know, every so often I, always, I, I often do find myself looking for some paper, like this would be a nice thing to have, like one of these, but um, of course it's the sort of thing I make the decision once I actually get to see the images, so... You know, I, I think I have these like saved uh, somewhere so I can always keep a track of them. But um, that's really all there is to talk about today. So in the comments, let me know, do you have any thoughts whatsoever on these <clears throat> journals and notebooks? But yeah, that's been the video. Thanks for watching and bye.